Hello everybody. Uh, I wanted to make a quick video to show you uh, how to extract a video from PowerPoint. Um, this is primarily for um, Mac products, so if you're running a MacBook like I am and uh, you have maybe a PowerPoint that has a video in it that you can see here I'm having troubles accessing it. It says Windows Media Player problem and whenever I went to download this plugin so that I could play my video that I wanted to show, uh, it wants you to buy software. So I tried to find a free alternative and I uh, came up with one with the help of YouTube. And it's a pretty interesting way we get to pretend that we're all computer hackers in the process. <laughs> so here's just this random um, PowerPoint that I got from Alabama Water Watch. And I wanted to use this amazing video on the Earth's uh, hydrologic cycle. But as you can see, I'm having problems. So the way to get around this, we can close out the PowerPoint. Uh, the first step you want to do is just to make sure we don't mess up our original file, unless you don't care about it, I'm going to make a copy of it. And now we're going to change its name from a PPTX, which is the PowerPoint file. We're going to change it to a zip file. This is why I made a new copy, just in case I mess it up. It gives you a warning. We're going to go ahead and do it anyway. Now, once it's zipped, this is the cool part. We open it up. It creates a folder for me. I'm going to open up that folder. I'm going to go into the PPT. And then I'm going to go into media. Now, this particular PowerPoint has a lot of media, tons of images. Uh, and that just depends on what kind of media you have in that PowerPoint. But you want to look for the .mob, which is way down, or excuse me, the .wmb, because this is a Windows Media um, video. So I'm going to copy that, paste it over here. Now you'll notice that um, this isn't a natural um, <laughs> software program that you'll have with your Mac. This is VLC, and you can download VLC for free. And once you have it downloaded, I have my Mac set up to open automatically with this program. So you download um, VLC. It has the orange uh, street cone. And this is an amazing software because it plays all types of video files. Uh, so now we won't have any problems accessing it, even though it's a Windows Media Player file. We will be able to run it with VLC. Okay. So I have successfully extracted the video, which uh, I was thinking there would be no way to do that. <laughs> but with the help of YouTube, I found a way, and it makes you feel like a hacker when you're switching the file type and diving into the files. So hopefully this will be useful to you. I can imagine a variety of scenarios where you need to pull out a file that's not working, especially if you're running on Mac for the first time. Uh, and this would be the same you know, if you wanted to get any of those images, but there's an easier way to pull the images from those PowerPoints themselves. But, um, okay, thank you very much, and I hope that's helpful.